Look at the front where it says Ames real big. everybody we're out here at Gabe's here in Laval or Laval however you say it just outside of Cumberland Maryland we're at Gabe's right now because Kayla wanted to look for a couple of pairs of jeans and uh, we were just taking a nice little road trip here on a nice gloomy rainy day here with the outer bands of Ian coming through uh, remnants of Hurricane Ian working their way through but we we're stopping here and uh, it gave me a chance to look at the Halloween goodies I have in here in this rather unique design building. I, I really don't know what it was before Gabe's, but anyway, let's get out of the rain and go inside and check it out. Yeah, here's a look at the Gabe's out here in Laval, Maryland, or Laval, however you say it. Now, I'm just, I'm dying to know what this was before Gabe's, if it was anything other than Gabe's. Only thing I could find on Street View get, went back to 2008, and this was... Uh, Gabriel Brothers with the old logo up there, but I couldn't find any info no matter how hard I tried online to see it, it, it resembles an old hills with the glass entrance and uh, Maybe possibly an old Ames even if Ames took over hills or Burlington's I've seen a couple of Burlington's that had glass entrances like this and Weiss grocery stores, but there's a Weiss not far from here and uh, so I'm really confused. I just don't know. If you know, let me know in the comments. Because I feel like it was an old hills back in the day. But anyway, let's go inside. It's raining out here. It sucks. I hate it. <laughs> we start off with the mats here. They have some really neat little doormats. Look at that one with the fox on it. That one's cool. And I don't know what the fox said. So let's not do that. This one's cool with the skeletons. What's this one say? The witch is in. <laughs> <laughs> they even have these little scarecrows here. What's up, guys? Look at the pumpkins. The happy, I guess, pumpkins. Open daily pumpkin patch. That's actually kind of cool. I like that. What do you guys think? Happy Halloween. That's pretty cool, too. Welcome, witches. Okay, what, what's up with this little lonely guy? Hello, fall. Hello. <laughs> Now over here they have lots of art as well. They have a bunch on the other side as well. The big welcome sign. If the shoe fits, get the matching hat and broom. Happy Halloween. What's this back here say? When you love a witch, magic happens. Cool. Which way? <laughs> Look at these little trash cans. These little jack-o'-lantern trash cans. That's actually kind of cool. Look at this one, the skeleton or the mummy. Happy Halloween. <laughs> and then over here we got Christmas trees. Look at that. Little, these are from Target, too. All right, so we're going there already. Her treat sign is pretty cool. Too bad half of it was blocked. That's actually really cool. Welcome, friends. I like that. Here they have more big signs. The big welcome sign. That's about five foot tall. That's almost as tall as me. The beware one. Trick or treat. Both of them. This one I thought was cute. I looked at the price. It was only $16.99. That'd be nice to put by our front door. I just wish it wasn't like kind of scuffed here like that. I guess I could paint it, go over the black paint, but that's all right. They got lots of ribbons, spider ribbons, happy Halloween. And then I'll look at all the wall art over here. Eat, drink, and be scary, trick or treat. More of the same, that one wants to fall over. Okay, every year it's the same thing. You make me wear this and wonder why I steal all the treats. <laughs> you are bootyful creep it real <laughs> they have some cool stuff happy halloween candy corn queen i don't know anybody that likes candy corn i'll say that happy halloween i'm here for the booze look at the happy little ghost on there pumpkin spice and everything nice that's cool eat drink and be scared look at these candy bowls holy cow give me candy <laughs> and here they have halloween pillows ghost card What's this big one say? Whoop. Welcome to our crypt. Okay. Not more in there. Oh, look at these. I guess they have skeletons and they're chilling in a coffin. <laughs> a lot of Halloween smocks, too. Look at this one with the kitties on it. Boo. <laughs> Trick or treat. They have all kinds of different designs. Several. Look at that one with the kitties on it. That's really cool. 
Yeah, they have all kinds in here too, all different sizes, designs. Queen leggings, pajama sets. Sure, it's more pajama pants over here. I'm too old for this sheet. <laughs> Momster, that's funny. Yeah, they got plenty of Halloween pajamas, leggings, sweatpants. Look at this one with the cats on it. <laughs> that's cool. Look, even more pajamas, onesies. Holy cow. <laughs> <laughs> so silly. But they have a lot. Working our way in here, we have more Halloween clothes. It looks like it's mostly pajamas anyway. Or like loungewear. Everything is just like so soft too. They even have items for the kids too. Kids uh, pajamas. I almost said costumes because I was looking at the costumes that they have right over here. They have some costumes. Not a whole lot anyway. But they have a few. And I imagine the sores are going to be different too. Trick or treat bags. Now this is a bag. I mean, that's a good one there. That is huge. Uh, you're almost at pillowcase size. <laughs> so but better than that. I mean, those are cool looking. But yeah, if you trick or treat the right way, you fill up a whole pillowcase. So that's cool. And yeah, more pajamas. We have some costumes here as well, hanging up on this rack. Then I saw out here we have Halloween themed cups, Tupperware. Um, like little jars, mugs, containers, lip smackers. Yeah, they have all kinds of goodies on here. Happy fall, y'all. Pretty cool. Look at the big tray here. Trick or treat. Pretty sweet. Table, they have some Halloween candy. Sour Punch Twists. Day of the Dead gummies, fruity flavors. Look at this, peeps, cats. <laughs> That's cool. They got more candy down there, candy corn. Yeah, no. <laughs> okay, kitchen towels and bake bakeware, silicone uh, spatulas, oven mitts. They're fabric, but then they have uh, silicone in here really helps to keep you from getting burned that one's cool that little set stay spooky not bad gift sacks okay they have headbands pot holders more trick-or-treat bags plenty the large ones again very good and they have more costumes here and lots of socks lots of Halloween socks Tons of them. This Gabe's didn't forget about Thanksgiving either and fall. They have lots of fall decorations in general. Harvest blessings. Give thanks. You see the uh, gnome holding a turkey. Apple harvest. I like those signs. Like I mentioned about the pumpkin patch one. Fall is my favorite color. Oh, so thankful. And then they have Halloween cards. Check that out. They have some. Might not have a lot, but they have some. Well, that wraps up that look at the Halloween goodies in here. Can't believe how many Christmas items they had in there, too. Gee whiz. <laughs> Tons of Christmas stuff in there for as early as it is anyway, but that's retail for you. Anyway, there's one last look at the outside of that place. This building was cool. Just can't figure out what it was before Gabriel Brothers. Oh, well, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give the video a like. If you're not a subscriber, please subscribe to the channel for more content. And until next time, take care, stay awesome, and since... I don't know where Kayla went. Have a uh, Gabe's delicious day. Bye.